What's going on, guys? We're all Tokyo back here with episode two of this um, Pokemon Nuzlocke. Through the generations and the series and all that fun, I can't tell you how excited I am to do this. But at the same time, I'm also recording this the same day I record episode one, so make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. Gonna go through the team. We got Zapdos here with Thundershock, Dropek, and Ice Beam. No abilities yet, obviously. And then we have Frank with Water Gun and Growl. I hope he gets sing. I think he does. Make sure you guys are leaving likes. Hit subscribe if you enjoy my content. You know it's free. You can always change your mind at any time. And uh, you know, feel free to leave a comment. I am naming Pokemon after you guys, after all. And names my son gives me so like i said in episode one these episodes are going to be anywhere from 20 to maybe 30 minutes we're going to get right on the uh, path here because uh we only got two pokemon we need to get through these trainers and i hope we don't lose anybody but when it comes down to it, thank you guys so much for watching my content. I greatly appreciate it. Like I said in the last episode, 150 likes each episode. And I will do a playthrough of Yellow while I am doing Gold. And I will upload the Yellow as well. So you'll get two games instead of one for those weeks. But, uh, we'll see if we get there. I know you guys can. I just, it's nice to see. I mean, you guys have smashed the like button on projects. Especially Project Episode Number 1s have done amazing. And then later in the project they do good again. I understand why the attention falls off. I'm sorry. I do my best. If you are watching this and you did not see episode one, there will be a playlist. Make sure you go back, check it out. As you can see, we got a Zapdos and a uh, Lapras. Wow. My brain just spasmed on me uh, as you also can see we have the first badge we beat Brock we got ice beam for our flying electric chicken slash Articuno now because he has ice beam uh, but <laughs> voltage and Frank make a great duo definitely gonna fight everybody so I can have as much money as possible because the magic cart yeah the um and the the Pokemon Center up here should be randomized as well what blast this I would love to get a Blastoise. Electric, a Legitor would be great too. I'm a snake. You are a snake. Alright, we're very close to getting our next partner. Yeah, you guys do awesome. Greatly appreciate all the, um, support you give. Duh! Duh! Definitely naming him Da. Da. It's a 
dragon? But it's a seahorse. That doesn't make sense. The nice thing is next generation. What, 251? 52? Maybe just 250. I don't remember. But we'll have the first two generations. So it should be Pokemon Blue, Gold, Ruby for the first three. And then I think I'm going to do Platinum. Yes, I know it's a special one, but I liked doing it when I did the series on that before. So that's where I am with that. I got a Vinny Ma. I have Frank and Vinny. How iconic. And we're gonna put Vinny on top of the team. But uh also I'm gonna be trying my hand at making this is my encounter. Oh, I wanted to disable that. Okay, rap actually is better to have disable. Because it's just hit. Hit. Wow, it didn't hit that. Wow, what a crit. Come on. Why won't you stay in the boat? I, and, and I'm also not playing that game, Link. I, I don't want to risk anything for no reason here. There we go. I got me Lance. Because it's a mother dragon. Well, dragon air right now, but will be in the future a dragon. We're on a pretty decent team. <laughs> I got Bide, which I believe is the actual TM you get from Brock. If I remember right. There's a Vinny now. Um, I don't know how useful Vinny is actually going to be through the series, but I'm definitely going to use him. Ooh, there. Good thing I'm super effective on you and not the other way around. Probably killed me in one hit. Put it down, heal. This episode probably will just be getting to Celadon, I think. Is it Celadon? Getting to Misty's Town. That's probably what this episode will be, so enjoy Mount Moon and think about Chancy, 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 dancing around a, uh, a um, Moonstone, because everybody knows that's what's going on here the whole reason Team Rocket's actually here. They want that fancy. They don't want it. They don't want it. the fossil or anything. They know about the real OG Powermon Chansey. Plus, I mean, there's a good amount of items to get in here. Scyther would have been awesome to get. 
this would have been even better. I'm just gonna try and run away because Gengar will ruin my day. T hey, Rocket, oh no, you have a Kakuna. Whatever will I do? Uh, yeah, you could probably use some some training, huh? Just gotta paralyze you real quick. Just Again, safety precautions, you never know. This thing pulls out like asteroid fire spin blast. And all of a sudden, Lance is gone and I'm wondering what I just got hit with. And we're just in bad shape, so we're just not going to do that. Oh, anyway, because I also believe I made the trade uh, Pokemon able to evolve at level 40. So, I could get Poliwag. Well, I guess you can get Poliwhirl from a, a Firestone, a Waterstone. You can get Arcanine from Firestone, Volplume. And, uh, Victory Bell from Leaf Stones. But, guess what? Machamp and Golem? Alakazam and Gengar? I believe are the trades. But, it is so odd seeing. All the old sprites, especially because, like I said in the first video, uh, doing a series with Crux Athens, make sure you go check them out, but uh, we are doing a rival walk through the series, and before that, I hadn't played these old games in a long time. Voltage, what are you doing over there, bud? I hit, it. I hit you with my Articuna Zapdos. Take the freezing lightning. Um, question of the day, I guess. Who's your favorite legendary from this one? Articuno, Moltres, Zapdos, or Mewtwo. Personally, Articuno is my favorite. I actually have my second favorite bird, because it goes Articuno, Mewtwo, Zapdos, Moltres. But, yeah, no. I can't wait for next gen, so generation 2, because then I have a chance to get my all-time favorite, Ho-Oh, and Entei. And then in gen 3, I have a chance for a Quasa and Groudon. From Gen 3 on, I have a chance. Oh, I did it. It, did it. it took me a second to realize it just transformed. Uh, from Gen 3 on, I'm pretty sure all the Pokemon will be in the game. But that's exciting. And, uh, Uh, if you guys want to, down below in the description should be a link to my Discord, and that's an easy way to know when I'm streaming, when I put up a video, when I do any of that, 
because all the notifications go there. I'm going to start being more active on Twitter again. Um, what else is there? But uh, you can actually chat with me on Discord. Um, and once I hit the point where I can have members, I will do a spreadsheet at one of my moderators will um, help me do, but uh, I would have a list of the Pokemon, and you can pick a Pokemon off that list when you become a member, when I get it to always be named after you during streams, during playthroughs, during runs, like any of that. And I need to start streaming like um Poker Road and stuff. It looks fun. I wanna try to beat it. But Oh, speaking of Moltres. Okay. Calcium, so that's money. Money, money. Money, money everywhere. So, also, I don't know if you guys are fans of the Fallout series or not. If you are, I hope you've watched the Fallout show on Angel Prime. 10 out of 10, highly recommend. It's amazing. But, uh, if you're not, it gives you something to look into as well. Because it's, it's a great show, it has a great. It does great tying in with. The games, I think, at least, in my personal opinion. Like, I love all the little innuendos they added for the show about the game. Um, for me, it was kind of predictable. I kind of see how it was going, but... Ooh! I could have had Voltage here. We don't play those games though. Leave me alone. I horn. I forgot I was low health. <coughs> We're just gonna change real quick. Yep. Awesome. Just gonna change real quick again. The fact that he could take one water gun is just amazing. The cave for me, that Moon's had some dumb strong Pokemon. Rank another level. Another level. Time to work on Lance a little. <coughs> also, like I was saying about the members, once I have, I'd probably say. A decent. I don't. I don't want to put a number on it, but I will also be putting out like members only content, obviously, to incentivize you guys to do that. But um, 
I will be doing member series. Like, if you have a computer and we can do a Soul Link or a A Soul Link, a Rival Lock, a We're not playing this game, come on now. Can, can you please stop with this nonsense? There we go. Um, we can do any of the Nuzlocke. Well, that tells me it's super effective on Dragon. But, um, any of that. Oh, the fossils are also randomized, so no idea what we're getting here. But, um, yeah, like, I want to do stuff with the community that is supporting me, so we will be doing members series which will go up on the channel as well and hopefully it will make you guys want to hit that subscribe hit that subscribe button wow tongue tied Ugh. no way this is my encounter I got me a blast voice I well I shouldn't say that yet Pokeballs do I have? That's a good question. Gotta name this turtle. By the way. Until somebody claims it, turtle, it will be. Also, if you're a person who uses Twitch to stream over there, but we're gonna call it there for this episode, guys. Thank you oh so much for um, all the support on these first episodes. Can't wait to see you guys again. Hopefully you had a great time. Make sure you hit like, subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace!